What is best in life? To crush your enemies, see them driven before you, and to hear the lamentation of their women. Hopefully. And let's update our title here real quick versus Norse. Alright, so that's all good. Alright, let's see if we can have a... Uh, let's see if we can get a Norse team that actually has Norse armor and not Orc armor. Yeah, I think those would probably be the two most chosen skills uh, as a second skill up. I'd probably go stand firm just because I like the ability to keep that guy standing exactly where I want. Like if you get him marking a ball and somebody tries to blitz him off so the ball carrier can run, you can just stay right there. Surely, I was going to say, surely you're not going to leave that guy open for me to hit, are you? Surely you wouldn't do that, would you? Yeah, I, I think I'd probably go with the stand firm, to be honest. Overload the one side. I normally don't do that. I normally like to keep guys on both sides just in case. <coughs> he gets the extra reroll. The kick does go to the side. I hoped it would. Oh, wow. He got fame times two. What, I roll a two? I did. Jeez. I rolled a two. He rolled an eight. Ugh. That's not a very good start. Ugh. Ay, ay, ay. That stinks. Come on, Mighty Blow. Do a job. Oh, that's... Yeah, that is Mighty Blow. There we go. KO. I'll take it. It's not a death or a kill, but it's still it's still a KO, so I'll take it. Oh. Darn it. Yay, I picked the ball up. Gotta love that. Gotta love that, baby. Heck yeah.
what he take again? He took a bribe. Couldn't remember what he took. No, uh, if I had a 12th guy, I probably would, but I wanted to protect my uh, my Blitzer, too. I didn't want uh, him to get a easy, mighty blow or claw hit against my Blitzer. If I go here and I don't get caught, he still has a hard hit on my Blitzer, but if I do get caught, then he has the open up hit on my Blitzer. With, uh, possibly with the Yeti, even. Yeah, he's going to blitz with the Yeti here. Yep. Now, if I can get the Yeti down next turn, I will foul him for sure. What's up, Stefanos, by the way? If he doesn't take him down on the first hit, then he goes into a one die. Nice. Now, come on, one die. Skull him up. Skull him up. Oh, he gets the yellow. Lucky dog. Claw doesn't do nothing though, that's good. So I will uh I will get the hit on the Yeti here. So let's do let's see here, how do we want to do this? Uh I don't have to do the hit on the Yeti, but I'm gonna. I am going to, I think. Actually, let's do this hit first. Here. Ugh. Stupid turnover. Stupid turnover. Two to hit. Nice. Ah, oh, that'd be a go for it. will foul the Yeti though and hope that I can get a 9 plus and not get caught well I didn't get the 9 plus but I didn't get caught and he's not gonna get a one die or a two die hit on my tomb guardian which is the more important thing and he can't get a two die hit here which is also an important thing he's locked up there which is good he's locked up here which is good this is the only guy in this guy here are the only two that can move freely without dodging that is an uphill there. For Kimry, depends on what I'm playing. If it's in a league or if it's in a short tournament or something of that nature. If it's in a league, okay, so he's going to do the blitz that way. Four, five, six. It is a go for it. Maybe I'll get lucky and he fails to go for it. Nope. And he gets the yellow. And he's got Mighty Blow. He'll probably break. Oh, nice, he didn't. Um, so, to answer your question, uh, my ideal starting roster, if it's in a long-term league, 
then I go. Uh, you always go all four team guardians for sure. But if, if it's long term league, I go both blitzers, a throw raw, four skellies, and two rerolls. If it's a short term, oh, I'm sorry, I said that backwards. If it's a short term, I go uh, uh, the two blitz rods, one throw raw, and two rerolls. Because I want to start building, uh, or I need that throw rod, you know, for the for the immediate build. If it's long term, then I go two blitz rods, uh, all skellies, five skellies, no throw raw, and I just wait to buy my throw rods. My first thing that I do, I'm either going to uh, uh, buy them right after my first game or after my second game, one of the two. Alright, so I think I'm going to move him here. That way I can surf this guy next turn, potentially. Before I do anything else, though, I'm going to blitz here. Get this guy beat up on, hopefully. Hopefully I take him down. Break him. There we go. Oh, and an injury. Nice. There goes one of the uh, berserkers. One mighty blow I do not have to worry about anymore. And that is Brian with the five SPPs. Or five Spidets. Get no. I mean, he could dodge out there if he wanted. Guess if he decides to do that, he does. I'll give him that opportunity if that's what he wants to do. <coughs> See if we can get a better hit this time. We got two assists on this one, so there we go. Ah, oh, just a stun. But I didn't get caught, so. So it would have been a 9, or an 8, 7, 6, so it would have been a 7 plus, and I rolled an 8. <laughs> Looks like the Norse armor is uh, not being orc armor, at least to this point. Uh, for the CL, I actually went with the uh, 2 blitz raw, no throw raw build, and I won the first game and made enough money that I bought the throw raw my second game. So the reason why I like to go that route is it allows you to start with three rerolls and it forces you to try to score with oh he makes the dodge without even having to make a use a reroll. God, that sucked. Ugh. That was nasty. No yellow. Yeah, of course he gets it. I was hoping he'd at least have to use a reroll. Wow, and he even catches it. Jeez Louise. Well that was about as perfect as he could have hoped for. Um, but anyway, it forces you to score with one of your Blitz Rots, right? Uh, which gives them SPPs right off the bat. Uh, and, and gets them closer to that first level. And if you don't win the first game or you don't make enough money in the first game to get the... Um, he doesn't reroll that, yeah. To get the, uh, the throw rod, then you just play the second game without it and you get it on. You definitely get it by the third game for sure. Um, there's no doubt about that. Go ahead and hit here first. Um, we'll push him. And then I'll do the hit here with Blitz, or with Frenzy, I mean.
Buffalo. Do a job, man. Jeez. Jeez Louise, man. Breaking a KO, nice. I'll take that. Didn't expect to get that one on that one, but I'll take it for sure. Ugh, I gotta re-roll it. Because I haven't picked the ball up yet. <clears throat> if I hadn't if I'd already picked the ball up and I had the ball in my hands, I wouldn't have re-rolled that. I would have just took the uh, took the both down. But I can't just leave the ball hanging out there without having nobody next to it or having it in my hands like that. But one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. At least I got him down to eight guys. That's good. He's missing a lineman, a wolf, and one of his berserkers. <clears throat> Yeah, if you lose a Tomb Guardian, whether it's a stat break or a perm on your first game, you you definitely restart. I restart if I if I lose a Blitz Rot too to a perm or a uh, uh, stat. Because you only got one game, only got one game at that point, right? There's no reason not to. Wow, he rose a freaking five, really? This dude with his dodging fucking ulfs. Killing me. And you know this man. man? That's right. And you know this man? him. Ugh. I need to get a level with him. Damn it. Alright, how do I want to do this? Let's do this hit first. I shouldn't have said that about their armor because obviously uh, they did bring the York armor. All of a sudden I can't break them to save my life after I got that first casualty. There we go. Just a stun, but at least it's a break. Skeletons aren't having a hard time breaking, are they? Seems to be about the only thing that can break. There we go. There's a turnover. Well done, you. Who was that? I might have to fire that skeleton story. <laughs> it figures it was him. Well, I think he's talking about after the first game, Stefanos. 
if it's your first game and you lose one, there's no sense in even trying to keep playing and rebuilding, right? It's only one game invested at that point. You just go ahead and re start the team over. What's up, Average Rice? Yeah, decay can be nasty, but that's part of it. You just get used to it. <laughs> yeah, I do need to put that one on there, don't I? Been proper fooked. He turns over. Might as well re-roll it. Can't take... Oh, and he makes the pro. Or the loner, I mean. Not the pro, sorry. He makes the loner. Nice. And then he gets the yellow on that one. Well done. Doesn't break, though. Claw is pointless on the uh, skelly, for sure. He can jump up there for one die. But yeah, I mean, he can't take his four re-rolls with him. He might as well re-roll it, right? Does the jump up. Gets the one high block for to knock him down. And KOs him even better. We'll frenzy the shit out of this dude, hopefully. These fucking ulfs, man. They're dodging like stupid. And he gets the takedown, too. Unbelievable. Unbelievable, man. Unbelievable. Well, so much for blitzing the uh, guy here now. That's not going to happen. Uh, Let's see here. I can get the hit here for sure. So let's do that. That pushes him out. There we go. can still go ahead and go after him if I choose. Let's do that first, though. Let's do this hit here. See if I can get a yellow. Perfect. Let's go ahead and put him on this side. Let's go ahead and blitz here. Frenzy. Do a job right here, baby. There we go. Oh, you gotta break him, though. Oh, you bum. You bum. Um, I think I'm gonna go ahead and pick the ball up first. Pick it here. One, two, three, four, five, six. One, two, three, four, five. That's good enough. Now I'm going to do the hit first, actually. Now I'm going to pick it up. See if I can make it go for it. Shoo! 
three, four, five, six. One, <laughs> yeah. Oh wow, I'm surprised he went into where he's going to stay marked. Oh, and he gets the two yellows anyway. Wow, he screwed up there. Well, I mean, he was going to be uphill no matter what. Yeah, he's going to be uphill no matter what. No matter which way he pushed him. Wow, and he gets the double yellow. Uh-uh-uh. That's gross. And he couldn't break the armor seven. Wow. I got lucky there. <coughs> yeah, that's definitely the blitz you want to do at that point. Oh, and he turns over. Shoo. All right, so he didn't hurt me. That's good. Didn't hurt me. Failed the loner on the reroll. That's good. I'm going to blitz here, so this guy's going to come around and mark him up. All right, so let's do this blitz here. Huh. All right, well, that sucked. That means I'm not going to be fouling, I don't think. Oh, man. Block dice all of a sudden, man, are sick. That's gross. He can actually he can actually get to me. Fuck. Ain't that a bitch. Well, that's good. At least he had to use his reroll there. Maybe I get lucky and he fails another. Oh, he didn't blitz. Did he not mean to blitz there, or did he mean to blitz? 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10. I think he meant to blitz and just missed it. But now he's pretty much got to dodge out here, right, to do it? You would think, anyway. Or does he just try to blitz the Tomb Guardian? Nah, I think he meant to blitz there and just messed it up. Oh, he gets the one die yellow. That sucks. Ugh. That really sucks. And of course he doesn't follow. Uh-uh-uh. Yeah, that sucked. Oh, he's going to do the blitz. Oh, he does the blitz on the blitz rod instead. I mean, it's... Your claw is pointless on him, so that doesn't bother me. I mean, he still gets the armor roll on it, but... Claw does nothing. Oh, kill yourself. Oh, he killed himself! Holy shit! Damn! Gotta use the APO there. Oh, he gets the badly hurt, so he'll be back. But, Apo's gone, so that's good. Alright, so if I hit him there, so I need you to be here. I need you to be up here. Now I just need a yellow here. Perfect. So I can push my skelly out. One, two, three, four, five, six. Yep, so I can do that. I'm not going to worry about doing that hit because chances, chances are I won't break him anyway. 
See if I can maybe get luck. Oh, I was gonna say, see if I can maybe get lucky and get a yellow there, and steal two extra SVPs before I score. <coughs> but no such luck. Talquin with the touchdown. No. We'll take it. We will take it. Nice. My other uh, throw rock comes back. He gets one of his three back. Let's get these guys off the line. So we got five. Zero and zero, right? Zero, five, zero, perfect. Put Mighty Blow here. Mighty Blow there. You here. You there. Puts right here. Puts right there. Throw right here. Throw right there. Looks good. Let's save this setup as defensive setup one. <coughs> oh, and Iowa Talquin. Some Spidens. Three of them, to be exact. Oh, man, that sucks, the finals. That's a rough run there. <coughs> Snatch was a great movie. Do you know what Nemesis means? A righteous infliction of retribution manifested by an appropriate agent. Personified in this case by, by an audible, audible cunt. cunt. May. May. Yeah, baby. <coughs> Armor 7, claw means nothing. Breaks anyway. Thick Skull saves me from the KO. Who is this 2 KO still out of Nolf? And the loner. The good news is... His... My, uh, uh, APO's gone. So every casualty from here on out sticks. Yeah. Yeah, you're not going to qualify against Cruz for most likely. Nice. Mighty Blow didn't do anything. His Mighty Blow has been pretty bad. Not a good foul. That's a... Uh, that's a... <laughs> and he gets caught, so he loses another guy. Oh, he's got the bribe. Never mind. Oh, he gets caught anyway. Holy cow. That, that is... That's not a bad, a bad foul when he has the bribe. I forgot he had the bribe. I was going to say that's a uh, on-tilt foul, but I don't think it was. Having the bribe, that was that was not a bad shot. Chances are you don't get caught and roll a one, but he did anyway. He gets one of the two back, but not the Ulf, which is good. <coughs> which is good. Crazy if he did, but you never know. <coughs> Four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven. Perfect. So he is now down to eight since he got a guy kicked off. His loner did come back. So now I just got to uh, get a few takeoffs here and then he'll have a hard time scoring. If I'm able to get the ball out and, and get a few guys off where he's definitely not going to be able to score, where it's going to be rough for him, 
then I'll try to score with one of these two Tomb Guardians if they haven't gotten a casualty by then. Try. We'll see. Oh, both teams lose a turn. That actually sucks. <laughs> Take down there. Oh, come on, loner, fail. Oh, almost got the double skulls. The double skulls there would have been so nasty. Would have been so nasty. No, he wasn't supposed to get the break. Yeah, now he blitzes here. on Yeti <laughs> yo oh, man that's the third time the Ye oh and he makes loner oh so third time he's had turnover block dice with Yeti two out of the three he makes the loner <laughs> that is just disgustingly sick right there oh two out of the three he makes the loner wow that's gross fail the pickup now oh that would have been really cool if he'd have failed the pickup Oh, this guy's right in my way, too. That sucks. Ugh, that really sucks, ass. Get him here. We'll get him here. Get him right on down here in the middle to lock these guys up. Get him down here to lock him up. job man for real dude do a job All I want to do is get a level on these two guys, man. That's it. That's all I want to do. All I want to do. All right, let's see what he does here. He might be stuck having to try to dodge with the Ulf again. No, he could do it that way. Oh, makes the dodge, darn it. Oh, he's going to do the one die there. He goes into it uphill if he doesn't take me down. Oh, he gets the takedown. Lucky dog. Ooh, that's gutsy. Oh, I see what he's doing. Nice. Fail that. Oh, he makes the catch. No way. It's all right. I can get to him, so. Oh, and he stands up there. Wow.
Oh, and he gets the yellow there, really? Jeez Louise, man. You gotta be kidding me. Alright, so here's what I gotta do. If I can push him to there. Yeah, I can get him there. So let's stand him up. <coughs> So that means I gotta get a yellow here. No, I just need a push. I just need to not turn over here. Good enough. I'll follow. Push him to here. Now I need a yellow here. I'm going to actually do this. I want to get three dice on this to make sure I get a yellow. Oh, really? I got to re-roll it. God, how do I get three dice and not get a fucking yellow, man? You got to be kidding me. So disgusting when that kind of shit happens. So fucking disgusting. That guy was meant to die this game. Brian with the death. Um, Brian. E R Y A N five O six gets fifteen for the kill. So here's the thing, do I risk the go for it and failing, or do I make him dodge out? Right? I think I gotta risk the go for it, just hope I can not roll a one here. Phew! I don't get the takedown, but at least I at least I'm still there with him, so he's gonna have to make the dodge out. Guess we're taking a push there. Man, I had to have to fucking reroll that three die block. Man, that sucks. At least I got the yellow on the reroll. That would have really sucked. One, two, three, four, five, six, yep. He can't stall. He's got to just try to score and hope that he can roll a 4-plus on the dodge here. Which is going to be not bad for me at that point. Yep. He has not had a problem dodging with those guys the whole game, man, unfortunately. Unfortunately, those guys have dodged like elves. The only one he failed was when he dodged into a tackle zone with one. Oh, and both of those guys are still out. Wow. The problem is I can't try to score with the Tomb Guardian now. Ah, oh, that sucks. But he's only got one, two, three, four, five, six guys left. Yep. So he's missing both blitzers now. That's good. No more mighty blow for me to have to worry about. And one of his ulfs is gone. So we get three there. We get three there. We're going to get three over here. <coughs> What did he say? Now I can't afford to try to score with a uh, with the Tomb Guardian, unfortunately. 
Unfortunately. Unless I feel like getting really stupid. But I just don't see that happening. Come on, baby, get a... Oh, this is the Mighty Blow piece, so it doesn't matter. But that is some points for the Mighty Blow piece, so I'll take it. That is on quick draw. Nice. One, two, three, four. And that's five spiders for him. This is the guy I need to get a point so he'll level. Come on, baby. Level up for me. So of course not. Why would I expect him to do that, right? Ah, really? <coughs> Gotta love when that happens. Gotta love when that happens. Let's see if we can just go ahead and pick this up real quick. Let's just go ahead and make it to where he can't get a even a one die hit on me if he does make a bunch of crazy dodges to get through there. <coughs> Let's be a little bit smarter with the hit here, or the, the protection. Dodge out here probably. Yep. Finally he fails a dodge. Oh, and he uses the last reroll on it too. There we go. Nah, I'm not even going to say it. <coughs> I'm not even going to say it. Let's do this. Let's just get him here. Let's go ahead and do a hit here first. There we go. Now I don't have to worry about the claw anymore. <laughs> 
Oh man. Do I really do this? I'm halfway tempted to try to throw it to him. I'd still have three more turns to pick it up, right? <coughs> Come on, baby. Five or six. Oh, I rolled a four. Come on, five or six. Yes! Yes! <coughs> I might score with him and level him yet. We'll see. No, he just hit in turn. Quick draw. What's up, man? Oh, I didn't, oops, didn't even see that. Alright, so who is this Supnugs with the touchdown and the level? <coughs> Supnugs with three. Doing the pillowette, pirouette. The spin. That's a good bounce back win after the last game. Maybe the other uh, Tomb Guardian will get the MVP in level if I'm lucky. A two's no good. We'll reroll that. Ooh, to a six. Nice. And no. Ah, oh, the wrong wrong Blitz Rod got the MVP. Dang it. it. Was supposed to be the other Blitz Rod that gets the MVP. <coughs> oh well. It is what it is. Oh, his ulf that scored the touchdown and did all the dodging got the MVP. That's nice. He got a level on him. He's probably going to kill the team anyway since his berserker died. <coughs> and he's 2-0-2 now, so. All right, let's go see what our uh, Tomb Guardian rolls here. Doubles, maybe, if I'm lucky. Oh, so close to doubles. Well, actually, it wasn't really close to doubles. So close to 10. I don't think I'd have taken a move break on him, though. Not as a first skill. A second skill I would, but his first skill, no. If he doesn't roll doubles, he automatically gets Mighty Blow. It's doubles or Mighty Blow, that's it. But I did get a third Mighty Blow, that's nice. Um... Gonna have my full roster back for the next game. Ah, Professor, hey, how you doing, man? Nope, nope. That was one of those games where the Vikings had Viking armor. Or the Norse had Norse armor. They didn't have the orc armor. <coughs> it's always one or the other. You either can't touch them or you demolish the crap out of them. That was the one where I demolished the crap out of them, unfortunately. For you, unfortunately. Good for me, though. Uh, I think I'm going to go ahead and spend 100 to start getting my stadium going. It leaves me with 80 still, so the next game, if I were to lose a, uh, a Tomb Guardian next game, I should make enough to be able to rebuy them. <coughs> and 
we'll have our full roster back for the next game. So we'll get our Skelly back. It puts us up to 5-0-1-1. That is a good one. Thanks for the game, by the way. Chaos, that was... Lo, there do I see my father. Lo, there do I see my mother and my sisters and my brothers. Lo, there do I see the line of my people back to the beginning. Lo. They do call to me. They bid me take my place among them. In the halls of Valhalla, where the brave may live.